Hello everybody, my name is Cats Games, and welcome back to the Ballad of Gay Tony. Now, I realized that there is a woman, I believe here. Was it a woman? Oh, there she is. Hello! Oh, it's that crazy bitch. Hey, Luis! Oh, Jesus, Margo. Fancy seeing you here. Don't tell me you were just passing through. Yes. When you suddenly decided the view was better from there? I knew you'd come. How? I'm sorry, Luis. Hey, don't apologize. I love keeping people from killing themselves. It's a weird fetish of mine. No. I mean, I'm sorry we can't be together. You can't have me. Bitch, I don't give a fuck. I don't want you. Now, come on, get down from there. Must be easy for you. Thinking of me as being crazy, it must help. Yeah, it does, actually. Either that or I think I was. You're not crazy, Luis. You're empty. You don't care about anyone. You're a shell. You fuck people and then you ignore them. That's easy. It's a game, isn't it? No, listen, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, wait, just... I just don't want to marry you, okay? Maybe I am empty, like you said. Or maybe, like pretty much every man alive, I don't want to marry someone who's a complete psychopath. Okay, I don't care which it is. Just get over here, please. When I die, people will blame you. Yeah, either that or thank me. What? Nothing, what? nothing. Come on. Come on, get over here. If you love me, you'd save me. I don't love you. I've got a letter telling everyone that you pushed me. Come on, get over here. Save me. Oh, God. Damn, she actually jumped. God, he just pushed her. Is she dead? I'm running away. I'm running away. I did not come in a car. I came in a taxi. Leave me alone. I did not push her. I did not. She wasn't 19. This guy tried to meet with a 15 year old. This guy tried to meet with a 15 year old. It's literally like a pred catch. Just everybody chasing this one guy who's running away. I'm not getting in this shit box. Where's my Uber that I called uh, to pick me up? Uh, don't play with the windows. Try not to, man. Right, let's do another Mori mission. Uh, my favorite character so far, actually. Yusuf is a bit too unhinged. Hey, Lou, come on in. Hang on one second. Check mate. See ya! <laughs> Little thicko never went to college. I never got into an Ivy League school. I got into two! Why is she not talking? Did they run out of budget oh, or something? Okay, <laughs> she cries. Get in the car, let's see. Take us over the bridge into the heliport. So, I got a proposition for you, Louis. It's Louis, bro. You know, being little Louise if I want it to be. You still owe me money, so you're still my bitch. Man, Tony, you owe me, bro. Making me hang out with this jackass. Now listen to me. I got a oh, wager. This is bad already. I ain't having no monster measuring contest, bro. I keep telling you I ain't into that creepy shit. No, my jackhammer would crush the shit out of you, bitch. No, 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 no. I'm talking a fair bet. Calculated risk. What's on the line then? You terrifyingly insecure midget? Well, <laughs> everything Tony owes me. And I promise to get out of your life if you win. Yeah, that sounds too good to be true, bro. What happens if I lose? I get everything. You're rolling with me full time, hombre. Buddies for life. Mwah. All or nothing, eh? Heavenly peace or a lifetime of being tortured by some hellish imp. Shit is tough. Calculated risk. What are you gonna do? Okay. So what are we betting on? It's a race, you fucking pussy. All around the city, only for serious high roller cats. Choppers, boats, cars, and, and everything in between. So all I gotta do well, is this win this game is so funny, it's actually... In theory, yes. But that ain't gonna ridiculous. happen, dog. Cause I never lost a nothing in my old life. Maybe that's because I had a brother as pathetic as little B. Or maybe it is because I am the S-H-I-T, bitch. Yeah, you shit, alright. Now if you do win, which you won't, you 
just gotta help me with one more thing. To that, all your contractual obligations are released. Fuck. Okay, here's that. So what do I have to win? Win a raise or something? I did not listen to the dialogue because I tried my best not to crash and I crashed a bunch anyway. Get your ass handed to you, you bitch! <laughs> hey, we're gonna give a head start to those on the four feet? Oh, it's a parachute race? You have all been provided! Parachutes, boats, and cars! You will be airlifted to the start where you will race from one vehicle to the next. The first person to make it to the finish in Middle Park is the winner. Are you ready? Fuck yeah! Yes, sir. You're racing an orange midget. Why wouldn't I be ready? Go! Okay. So... Uh... Okay, there you go. <laughs> Almost forgot how to activate parachute. Right, we gotta get into one of the boats. Hopefully the smallest one, because I believe that one's the fastest. Which one is the fastest? I want to get in the small one though, I don't know why. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. I'm pressing F, I'm pressing F. Are they still up in the air? They are, okay. I'm in the lead anyways. Are those mines? I don't think so. There's no mines in this game, I don't think. They were in Chinatown Wars, so... That's what I'm thinking. Also, there's like a plane up in the air. I just saw a plane. It disappeared now, but there was a plane up there. I thought there's no fucking plane in this. I literally... I don't see a single boat behind me. I literally finessed... Oh wait, there's a boat there. Okay, they're not that far away. I thought I literally, like... Left them in the dust. But now they're catching up slowly. Right, hopefully cars or something here. Get in a car. Fuck. Get out, get out the boat. Ugh. I want to get in that fucking Maserati. Come on. You're not winning, you gimp. Can I kill one of them? I don't think I can. This guy's right on my ass. Caps lock to activate nitro, hold on. This sand is very slippery. Fuck's sake. Nitro. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I will not use those around a fucking corner. Oh, there's a corner right here. Okay, I can use it here. Straight road. Come on! That's the finish line already there. Not even gonna look look around. Actually, no. Yeah, everyone left in the dust. And I apparently drove over a person and I did not see that because I was so focused. Ouch, man. That's gotta be an expensive race for you. Bullshit, man. Someone must have sabotaged me or something. No, shit, no, I wanted to lose. You think ponies cash mean shit to me? I got other investments. Yeah, good for you, Tiny. So, uh, <laughs> we gotta see each other again? I told you, Louie, one more job. I got some cars to procure and you're gonna help me. Come by Brucey's and we'll hit it. Yeah, all right, bro. I gave my word. Lovely. I gotta keep the car as well. Which I'll actually go and park outside the house because I need to go save just in case anyway because you never know when this game is going to fucking crash. And it seems I have unlocked a race or a triathlon as they call it so it's, there's more of these to do. I'm of course going to do those off screen probably. Probably going to do the parishes off screen but I have apparently a male here to visit and fuck in the ass. Okay here we are bucko. Who the fuck is this? Oh this is the French guy again. Luis. Damn, yeah. you guys ass beat or something. Thank fucking God, I can see you. Thank you, God. Maybe you do exist. Uh, Arnold, what are you doing down here, bro? Uh, well, 
We had a little incident. I don't mind when the girl play rough, but when the pimp come in and he plays rough too... Oh, la, 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 la. What happened, bro? I tell you, it is a bad combination. Chinese opium and Brazilian prostitute. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, Ooh, not a good fucking... I, I was just uh, holding <laughs> off after a little bit of light after dinner bondage and... Not and a good the combo. The comes in, he steals my wallet and gives me a good beating. <laughs> For watching too much television? <laughs> somehow, uh, somehow I feel my dignity is still intact. Wait a second. You're a guy who just enjoyed an opium-laden threesome with some light bondage. How could your dignity ever be in question? <laughs> exactly, <laughs> my friend. Uh, well, maybe you can help me uh, get back the wallet. Hey, compared to the shit I dealt with today, okay, that doesn't sound so shady. <laughs> <laughs> so why the fuck you not? <laughs> All right, let's get his wallet I back. Right, let's steal a car. Sorry, bro. Get the fuck out. Oh, for fuck's sake, the coppers. Why is this the only car around? Like, literally, it's either this car or a taxi. Just ask me for the money. If he needed it, we could have made an arrangement. Perhaps a little four way. Maybe he didn't want to subject himself to no bondage, light or otherwise. He was perhaps more dumb than sub, that's true, but surely being a pimp implies some perversity, or at least curiosity. It would have been an experience. Yo, don't worry, bro. We're gonna subject him to some shit soon enough. Life is an unpredictable thing, my friend. You don't need to tell me. Here's an example for you to digest. This morning, a delicious 22-year-old girl left her parents' apartment in Middle Park East. The only thing on her mind was buying a coffee. But uh, I made her a proposal. Soon she was drenched in champagne, bent over naked in my hotel suite. <laughs> Before 11 a.m., she was shoveling cocaine into her nose with a caviar spoon and begging me to give it to her again. And a few hours later, you was getting your ass beat by a pimp in Mohan. Life sure does twist and turn. Touche. I should introduce you to my boss, bro. You guys can party together. <laughs> Perhaps on my next trip, yeah, no doubt. If we survive that long, you're on. That's him. Do you think you can get my wallet back? Of Mother course. Driving off. Look at him. Damn it, this car is not really good for Chase. But this idiot crashed. I, I killed an innocent person by accident. Oops. Hey yo man, where's the wallet? Give me the wallet. Why don't you lie over there? And I'll take the car. Oh there it is. I'm gonna drop you around the corner, bro. It ain't safe here. Get in the vehicle, man. Here's your wallet, bro. I'd stay in Afghanistan from now on if I was you. Things get rough out here in the boroughs. They do. And that's why I like it. It's your life you're playing with, bro. I just don't want to see you end up one of them deviant sex stories gone wrong. Like one of them guys who strangled themselves trying to get off. Civilian like you coming out of the <laughs> is almost a suicidal. You know how to handle a vehicle, my friend. Yeah, once I get used to the fucking handling of the game, I'm actually a pretty good driver. Okay, there you bro. go. This is where I'm leaving you. You still might get robbed around here, but they won't kill you. Adieu, dear boy. It's been fun. Goodbye, man. I wonder if we'll see him again. Okay, so y'all know how much I want to actually win this. We're going to try the fucking Fight Club again and try and actually win this time. I'm going to try with controller. Maybe it's easier to dodge because with space bar, it's, it seems weird. I'll pretty, I won't show everything because you all saw everything in the last episode or the episode before. I can't remember. So yeah, I'll just skip to the, the round I left off last time. What the fuck happened there? Well, I'm almost dead because I don't know the button to dodge. It literally, I thought there was going to be a pop-up that will show me um, how to dodge and actually use the controls on, on the controller, but it, they literally didn't pop up, so fuck the game, I guess. And now I have to pretty much sleep, get my health back, and then try it again.
That is retarded. I can't dodge. I'm pressing space to dodge. I press space to dodge, bro. What a bullshit, like, fucking melee system. The amount of times I, pr I press space right when they fucking attacked and he didn't dodge. Whatever, that's my attempt for this fucking episode because I already spent 10 minutes doing that. You know what, fuck it, I can't, I can't, I need to win this. I really need to win this. How did I miss? Alright, here we go. Round four. Five, actually. This might be the last one, I think. I need to get that bat, though. I'm literally pressing space! Oh my fucking god. Y'all can hear me pressing space. Every, before every attack he just did that, I press space. Louise does nothing. Nothing. What a fucking annoying game. Oh my god. I might have to do that off screen. That is like, uh, it's so annoying. It's actually so fucking. I wasted 15 minutes. Not even. 20 minutes doing that shit. And he does nothing. Whatever. I guess. No, I can't give up. Got an achievement. Complete 10 melee counters in 4 minutes. Right. Welcome back to round five. Seems to be easier to dodge with controller since I know now how to. All right, round six. I don't know how many rounds there are. This is the final. Took the knife off him. Okay. Yes! Yes, I fucking won! Oh my god, that feels so good. Oh, do this with controller if you have a PC. It's so much fucking easier. Like, he literally dodges, like, perfectly. I was doing the same thing with Spacebar and it just didn't work. Oh, that feels amazing. Is this how playing Dark Souls feels like? Because I might start playing Dark Souls. Get pissed off and then just fucking get the satisfaction at the end. I'm gonna go save straight away. All right, let's do the final Mori mission for the final... Fight part of this episode. Number three. 32. Number, or not final part, but like final mission of the episode. 30. Oh, come on! Ah, come on, one more, come on! Ah, screw you, Mori! Why you gotta be such a cock? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Oh, fuck you, Mori! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck me? You can't fuck me, baby B. Name one thing you have ever been able to fuck me at. One thing! Huh? I lift more weights, I fly better choppers, I have better cars, I screw better women. Hell, I screw women. My bling ain't CZ, and my paper ain't a photocopy. What's up, Lou? So again, one! Ah, <laughs> I gotta side with your brother on this one, man. I mean, you're fucking annoying. I mean, I work in nightclubs, I hang out with gangsters. I meet assholes 24 hours a day. But you, you take the cake, man. Oh, jeez, oh, I'm sorry. Sorry that I'm trying to toughen up my little bro here. My little bro who I love more than life itself. <laughs> And you think that you can interfere with that? You know, I think maybe you're taking the tough love thing a little too far, man. I mean, I got sent to juvie when I was 17 years old for shooting a teacher who felt up my sister. They tried the tough love thing with me. It didn't fucking work too well. So maybe try a different fucking approach. You know what? Are we gonna fight? I think you might be right. Come on, baby B. Let's hug it out. Yeah? Let's hug it out. Okay! Ah, I love okay. you. I love you, I do. I love you. It's just, the truth is, I'm... I'm jealous. 
I am. I'm jealous. I'm jealous that, that you are dating such a wonderful guy as Louis. <laughs> Whatever. I'm only kidding. Come on. Jesus, you guys are a couple of pent up queens, I swear. Come on, let's go have some fun, huh? You too, B. Come on, stop sulking. Jesus, you're pathetic. <laughs> I love you, but you're they... such a pussy. Yeah, why are they making Brucey such a pussy? It wasn't like this in GTA 4. Yeah, we got some cars waiting at the top of Middle Park, bro. Hey, I got a gift for you bitches. Some headsets so I can tell you what I'm trying, bro. All right, let's go. Hey, Brucey, bro, it's good to hang with you. I'm really happy you're along on this ride. Bory, bro, are you fucking with me? Come on, little B. Hey, what do you take me for? It's good to have Lopez along too, right? Hey, the three amigos. <laughs> Yo, two men and a little cunt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, you hear that, Brucey? He called you a little cunt. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't talking about him, bro. Don't bring down a positive energy, Lopez. Me and my brother are having fun today. Yeah, man, we are. Do this for often, bro. Oh, B, shit. Before I forget, there's this email that I got that I thought you'd be interested in. Oh, yeah? What's that? Oh, you see, it's this doctor. He's a fucking genius. Yeah, he says he's made this bill that it's gonna sort out that penis problem you got. Nah. Fuck off, boy. I thought you were being cool, bro. No, no, I am, bro. I swear it. No, this guy can extend your hose by at least two to three inches. They call me an asshole, but I'd be really psyched if my bro was back in a four-inch punch. How's that for cool? Shut up, Corey. The one thing you do got going for you is those roid rabbit's beans in your sack. Yeah, anything would look big hanging next to those peanuts, right? Huh? Am I right? Shut the fuck up, Corey. Pathetic. <laughs> 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 you see this guy, Lopez? What did I tell you? Yeah, I don't know, bro. I tend to stop listening when you open your mouth. Remind me again what you paid for that place in Broker, Brucey. Huh? Oh, and a garage, too. How much did you pay? I don't want to talk about this. And, uh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. What are those properties worth now? <laughs> I said I don't want to talk about it, okay? Shit. Shit. You see? What did I tell you, Lopez? Overexposed like a stripper in Fleet Week. Only thing more useless than that little pecker of his is his portfolio. Ain't that right, Brucey? Hey, leave him alone, <laughs> You're even more annoying than you. This guy you fell like over the pipe or something. Hey, you guys should start a debtor's anonymous circle jerk together. <laughs> yeah, you can sit around crying and hugging and talking about how you lost it all, huh? <laughs> yeah, at least we don't owe you shit anymore, Maury. Remember, that that guy erased in that bet. Fucking genius. Ah, here's our guy with the cars. Hey, you chunks could learn a thing or two here. All right, let's see what we got to do here with these exotic cars. Hey, buddy, gold, gold-colored cars in this game look amazing. Thanks, bro. Hey, no shit. Spend that all in one place, chump. All right, people. Where's that yellow? Money talks. Yellow goldish, walk. anyway. Not actually out of gold because that didn't exist in this GTA Five. You can get fucking cars with pure gold. Man, I'd love to let's play GTA Five if it wasn't so long. I haven't been that game since 2017, like. And I do want to beat it again. Hopefully this mission is not stuck. Hello? Okay. Um, I don't know how I got it to work, but it's working. I pretty much didn't play the... I'm not playing the game full screen right now. So I guess... <laughs> I don't know, bro. This game's so broken. Like, I even have the patches from, like, the Steam fucking guide. The, like, that's the only reason I didn't reinstall the game when I had other problems. It's it's so go, go. Is a bitch. It's, it's so badly fucking done this game this port it's still not fixed after the Windows Live shit it's ridiculous hopefully they remaster this game yeah man how they know what's up wake up pansies I call them shit just got intense huh are you Alpha or Omega you think you can handle it what is with that taxi. He literally just drove right into me. See ya, man. Come on, Lopez, we're waiting. The cops are gonna get it for sure. You think 
Right, hopefully I won't fucking hit something and go into the water. Why is, why did I say that? I'm gonna jinx it now. It's so hard to drive in the rain. I did just do a cinematic camera. Oh god. Okay, there's a jump. Ramp, just perfect. Please tell me I landed. I did. Now go easy on this one. You don't want to overshoot the third. Bring her home, bitches. Yes, I made it. I thought this was a GT4 mission, no? <laughs> <laughs> They're all mixing up in my memories, to be honest. Intense. Yeah. Oh, did you see little Lou here, though? He started shitting his panties when the cops showed up. <laughs> no, I was actually shitting my pussy. pants you know, when I we were hitting Lou those ramps. Might be even slightly bigger pussy than you. <laughs> we're done, right? I mean, we're squared. You got your cars now. So now I don't have to sit here and listen to your tiny Okay, Maury, Maury is annoying as fuck, though. Sure, sure, Lou, sure, sure, sure. He's you not my go. favorite. If you're as dumb as you look. Ooh. Excuse me? You got an opportunity here. Look at me, look at me. Watch my lips move. I can teach you things. Come on! Think apprentice. Think uh, intern. Minion, yeah. Think, Please uh, punch him. Squire boy. You, following me all around, learning to become a business mastermind. No more clubs. No more Tony Queen. You, my friend, could be free. <laughs> Maury, is this a joke, man? I mean, you're the guy that needs to learn something. Oh. Shit, you're awful, bro. I mean, maybe someone can teach you the most basic human behavior. Brucey, please, do this guy a favor. Brucey? Me? Yeah, what? you're the guy in the family with some manners. Whoa. You think that I could learn something from little B here? Is the Mario in GTA 5 or is it Brucey? This failed piece of turd. All right, in, in GTA out. Online. Man, Let's forget. Nothing but beyond right. pathetic. That's it, boy! Cut it out! Yeah! Yeah! Are you yeah. kidding? Yeah. <laughs> yes! Oh, 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 God, oh. That's what you deserve, ah, what cunt. The fuck, man? What the fuck are you doing? Oh, God, you know the rules. Oh, I'm sorry, Maury. Ah. I forgot, man. Never, never in the face. Oh, come on. This is, this is top work up here. You know that I got a week in Zepta. Okay. Oh, just, just, just don't tell mom, okay? <laughs> okay? Okay, okay, okay. Just. You gotta take me home. <laughs> yeah, shit. Okay, yeah, shit. Come on, let's go. Okay. <laughs> He's crying like a little bitch now. Okay. Hey, I'll see you ladies later, okay? Yeah, uh, uh I'll see you at the club or something. Okay. Yeah, I heard something. Lovely job. I am satisfied, man, that I complete this mission and we got a nice ending towards the mission of Maury's annoying ass getting punched in the fucking face. Well deserved. And now I swear to God if it's stuck on the loading mission now, I will be very pissed. Or a loading screen, sorry, not mission. Okay. Anyways, y'all saw the mission and everything. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Cats Games and I will hopefully see you in the next episode if I either even end up making another episode because this is fucking ridiculous. See you next time.